Hi guys, I'm Max Kausch from AndersSpecialist.com and I'm here to talk about Aconcagua equipment. Uh, we have a lot to talk about, so we're going to break up the list uh, in a smaller bit. So I hope you enjoy it. Uh, very important items for, uh, to make sure we have a success in a expedition like this is hydration. Uh, there are many uh, different opinions about hydration uh, in Aconcagua. Uh, if you do have these hydration bags, uh, make sure you have options, not just the hydration bags because they do freeze, even though sometimes you have this uh, insulation uh, tube on the outside and that cover even then they freeze. Uh, in Aconcagua, you can probably take this guy um, maybe up to Camp Chu sometimes. Sometimes it might freeze even on the way to Camp Chu. Uh, and they poke, sometimes they leak. They're actually very practical uh, during the approach. I actually prefer them having during the approach. Um, but do make sure you also bring uh, bottles uh, like Nalgene bottles, there are many kinds in the market nowadays. I prefer having the ones uh, with big lids, so because we fill them up the, all the time. We fill them up for you, you don't have to melt the snow up there. We do that for you, we purify the water, you don't have to bring uh, purifying tablets, uh, any of that. We actually have people uh, to melt the snow for you, but make sure they actually have a, a, a bigger top, not just a, a, a thin neck bottle. Uh, these uh, plastic bottles are the best uh, for this. I would have enough for two liters uh, or three liters. Uh, we do have a bit of the approach that we might need uh, three liters. Uh, also, you need a, a thermos on the way to the summit. Uh, we cannot take uh, hydration bags like these guys. Uh, they actually freeze on the summit and these bottles also freeze in the summit. We have them inside our rucksack and even then it freezes. We usually have this just for the way down of the summit, but for the summit itself, we need a good one liter thermos with a lid you can drink, you can top up and drink. Uh, sometimes it's the only source of liquid we have during the summit push because everything else freezes. So uh, do make sure you have a good one of these. Uh, you can actually buy these in Mendoza. Uh, we don't have an option to rent them, unfortunately, but um, uh, it's an essential item from our list. I would not take these thermoses. Uh, this is actually a thermos a flask that has vacuum in the inside but it has no drinking lid, I cannot drink it. So sometimes when I do that, it's so hot, I burn my mouth. So uh, I actually prefer having uh, the ones with the cup. Uh, do make sure it's a liter. Uh, 750 mils uh, might not be enough for a semi push like Aconcagua. Any questions you have, uh, please post it under the video or just send it to us at info uh, andis specialistcom